Mount Shasta Brewing Company is a brewery in Weed, California, USA. The company markets some brands as Weed Ales and Lagers. Owners Vaughn and Barbara Dillman began commercial production in 2003. Mount Shasta Brewing Company is licensed to distribute its beers in the states of California, Oregon, and Washington. The brewery has won awards for its beers, for local community involvement and for its marketing success with the slogan, Try Legal Weed. History Oakland police officer Vaughn V. Dillman left Oakland in 1974 with his new bride, Barbara. The newlyweds settled near Mount Shasta, her family had earlier ties to land in the area. Vaughn Dillman purchased the Black Butte Saloon in Central Weed and operated it for 25 years. During this time Dillman helped sponsor the rebuilding of a large sign welcoming visitors to Weed, the sign arching over the town's main street leading to the saloon. Barbara M. Dillman served for a time as Siskiyou County Superintendent of Schools. Dillman long wished to brew beer in the tradition of his German ancestors who settled in Milwaukee. In 1992, he bought the 18,000 square foot (1,700 square meters) Meadow Bell Creamery building in Weed three days before it was to be auctioned off. In renovating the 1952 building into a brewery, serious gasoline soil contamination was discovered, traced to leaking gasoline tanks and pump facilities used for decades to fuel Meadow Bell's fleet of trucks. Dillman was granted $995,000 in state funds intended to remove contaminants from underground storage tanks, and the property was finally pronounced clean in May 1999. The building took further improvements before beer could be made. Skylights were cut in the roof and the interior ceiling was clad in insulated plastic. Brewing equipment was brought from St. Paul, Minnesota, a 1938-24 barrel, 740 gallons, 2800L brew kitchen outgrown by Summit Brewing Company, and from Davis, California, where Dillman bought a modern 15 barrel, 465 gallons, 1755L pub system. The first commercial keg beer was brewed by Mount Shasta Brewing in 2003, Weed Golden Ale. In 2005, the first batch of bottled beer was produced. In 2007, the brewery's Shastafarian Porter placed first in the Porter category in Sacramento at the California Brewers Festival. The next year at the festival, the brewery's Mountain High IPA scored top India Pale Ale honors, edging out Bear Republic's highly regarded Racer 5 IPA, and their sour cherry infused summer seasonal brew, Mount Shasta Creek Ale, came in third in the fruit beers category. Also in 2009, Mount Shasta Brewing Company was named Business of the Year. By the Weed Chamber of Commerce, in 2003, two months before Mount Shasta Brewing Company released its first product, Butte Creek Brewery in Chico, California, came out with a brew they patented as Mount Shasta Pale Ale. Butte Creek sued for control of the trademark of Mount Shasta Brewing Company, but Dillman won the suit after a significant effort in proving his claim. The brewery distributes its bottled beers to retailers and also serves beer in its tasting room and restaurant. The tasting room features an oak bar saved from Rosie's Saloon in nearby Fort Jones. Occasional specialty brews such as Strawberry Porter and Stout of Jefferson are only available at the tasting room. Being near the College of the Siskiyous is a boost to business, according to Dillman, as is being near Interstate 5. Mount Shasta Brewing is one of three breweries in Siskiyou County, California. The other two are Dunsmuir Brewery Works and Etna Brewing Company. Topic. Slogan controversy Dillman says he freely uses the town's name in his marketing by permission of the descendants of lumber baron Abner Weed, the town's founder and a state senator. Mount Shasta Brewing Company's website domain is www.weedales.com, and Weedales is trademarked. Dillman says the brewery relies on tourists for 92% of its business, and he uses the weed name in double entendre, playfully, to promote the brand. Some of the company slogans are, Try legal weed. A friend in weed is a friend indeed. 
and weed, a flavor yet to be discovered. The slogan, Try Legal Weed, has appeared on the bottle caps of each product in the brewery's line since 2008. In April 2008, the company was ordered to remove the slogan by the Alcohol and Tobacco Tax and Trade Bureau because of the perceived endorsement of an illegal drug. The Dillmans argued that they should be allowed to exercise their freedom of speech, and that the slogan refers to the town of weed and advertises a legal product. Dillman said he has never in his life tried marijuana also known as weed. Dillman was invited to speak about the issue on regional and national television programs, local radio shows, and he was interviewed by reporters from many countries. The American Civil Liberties Union expressed their intention to challenge the ruling on the basis of the First Amendment guaranteeing freedom of speech, but in October 2008 ATTTB reversed their decision after additional review. Upon hearing the news, Dillman said, We'd fought the law, and we'd won. The following year, the Dillmans were honored by the United States Commerce Association's Best of Local Business Award program for positive contributions to the local community and their marketing success in the battle to retain the slogan. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Main Brews. Abner Weed Amber Ale, Lemurian Lager. Mountain High IPA Shastafarian Porter Weed Golden Ale Jalapeno Ale Seasonal brews Skip and Go Naked Sour Diesel Stout of Jefferson Abner Weed's Apple Pie Ale 530 Mount Shasta Pale Ale